I'm Melissa Sardelli here with your online nightly newscast. Here's a look at the stories getting the most clicks on WPRI.com for Thursday, January 6th. From the East Bay Mobile Newsroom, Eyewitness News in Tiverton now, where the scene of a serious crash on Route 24. The driver of a pickup truck lost control and rolled over into the woods around 7 o'clock this morning. The highway had to be closed so that a medical helicopter could land nearby. State police aren't commenting on the victim's condition. A notorious Rhode Island killer has died while behind bars. 30-year-old Denard Walker was serving a life sentence at the ACI for the murder of 15-year-old Jennifer Rivera. Rivera was gunned down in Providence back in 2000, just before she was slated to testify against an accused killer, Charles Pona. Walker was found dead in his prison cell this morning. The Department of Corrections says the death is not suspicious and it's possible he died of natural causes. Eyewitness News moving to Warwick now where we've learned the victim from Tuesday night's accident there has died. State police tell us Lawrence DeRizzo died at the hospital from his injuries. He was initially trapped in his van after it rolled over on the Route 37 on-ramp from Post Road. As for the cause, we're told it remains under investigation. And police have made an arrest in connection with a fire in a Middletown store. We first reported the fire at Tuesday morning as breaking news last night. Now police tell us a store employee admitted to setting the fire. 27-year-old Stuart Moody is held without bail on arson charges tonight. We've learned the fire was started in two different places in the store. Firefighters tell us the store remains closed because of smoke and fire damage. And for all of your up-to-the-minute online news and weather, stay with WPRI.com. Thanks for watching.